So welcome to the Health Science Center. I'm Clay Marsh and I am the Vice President and Executive Dean of the Health Science Center here at WVU. This is a place that you're going to be spending a lot of time. And if you're a student coming to join us for the first time, welcome. And if you're a student who's uh, returning, welcome back. So we want to take you on a really quick tour of the important places in the Health Science Center that you're going to want to know uh, as, you, uh, as you get going with your year. So come and join me and let's go. Here's where you'll learn and take notes. This is where you can grab a bite to eat for breakfast and lunch. Here's where you can eat your lunch and study. So one of the secrets I want to share with you guys is as you're studying hard and you're trying to figure out what to do between classes, you should come here to Kavanaugh's and get a cup of coffee. I find that works for almost everything. This is Lucas. He'll be visiting your classes from time to time and is a huge fan of belly rubs. So what's really great about the environment that you're going to find yourself in is you can come to a really quiet place where you can get into your studying and you can really concentrate. And of course, it's always a good time to have some coffee. Here's where you'll unwind before, between, and after classes. I might even challenge you to a game. Here's where you'll develop a green thumb, unwind, and grow some natural produce. Here's the health science pylons. When I was here, they were outside, now they're inside. Pay attention because you're gonna get a lot of pictures taken in front and with these pylons. Here's where you'll meet my friend. Here's our award-winning patient care hospital. So during your time that you are here, you're going to change a lot. You're gonna grow professionally and personally. You're gonna be challenged, but you're gonna have a lot of fun and you're gonna really understand the commitment that we have in our community that we want to take care of the population of the state of West Virginia first, but then we wanna spread that to the rest of the world. So with your help and with your commitment for the future, we know that West Virginia can be a state that other people come to to understand how we have moved from disease-based healthcare to really embracing health. So for that, I hope you really understand that your future really does start here.